In terms of building coalitions, you've actually already, uh, 13 months out, named your running mate, yeah. uh, Representative Peggy Flanagan, who has certainly progressive chops. Uh, critics again say, you're, 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 um, is this an effort to, to appeal to the progressives in the DFL party? Because you are actually a lot more conservative than she is on some positions. Well, I think we have a lot of shared values. It, it, it's about, again, building coalitions to solve Minnesota's problems, traveling across Minnesota. They're sick of our divided politics. They're sick about this idea that there's a spectrum that people need to follow on. I've respected Peggy for her work in early childhood. Um, she's actually a friend of mine prior to me being in politics. And, and what I would say to them is, is that we're not going to do things the same way. We're not going to wait to the seventh ballot of a DFL convention to pick someone that might put you over the edge or whatever. I'm going to get out there with a partner who I know uh, has different life experiences, someone who's uh, of the white earth nation and Ojibwe woman and uh, someone who didn't grow up on a farm the way I did but can bring that perspective from an urban perspective to a rural perspective and unite the state.